Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those who for those who don't know me, my name is Sienna, but if you do know me then hi. Today I'll be reviewing the book reviewing this book called Coming to England by Fluella Benjamin. I particularly chose this book because this author is a black author and it it ties in with the Black Lives Matter movement at the minute. And I also chose this book because I want to get people's attention on this on this because nobody has done a review on this book on YouTube and if you do decide to read this book I really hope that you will review it so I can have a look and see your opinions on it. This book is about um, a true story of Fluella and how her parents went to England from Trinidad because they were in the wind, run, wind rush generation from the 1950s slash 1960s and it also tells us how um, Fluella and her sister boarded a ship to go to England by themselves. I really like this book because it told us how Fluella experienced racism for the first time in her life and it also tells us how Trinidad is so different from England because in Trinidad it um, it is so sunny and warm. There's always fresh fruit and fruit and food on the market, and Fluella is always very happy in it. But in England, it is very like raining, cold, and dull, and the food is there is not very fresh, and Fluella's, Fluella is not very happy in it. Happy in there. There's no bad things at all about this book because I really enjoyed it. And the vocab, um, well, it is quite very, very easy. And the book's quite short, so it will only take like a day or two to read it. And the chapters are very short. And the illustrations, there's quite a lot of illustrations rather than my last book that I reviewed, The Curious Incident of the Dog in the Night Time. Um, and the and the illustrations are like watercolor themed, like so. And I would rate this book eight out of ten. Yeah, eight out of ten. And I I think I would um, recommend this book to people who are seven and up, and mm, to pe to all genders at all. Uh, and people who love to find out about black history and love adventurous uh, books and adventurous people and maybe books that are set in different countries at first and then go to different countries which are quite good that I like but that's all I had to do for today guys on this reviewing of this book but I just want to say I am so thankful for all of these parcels that are most probably are contained in some books. I will be opening them in my next video, but I'm just waiting for one more parcel. Um, but yeah, I hope you have a lovely day, guys. And don't forget to like, co comment, share, and make sure to subscribe, please. Bye.